Very pretty. Oh, love it. Do you love it? Yeah, I knew it. You knew it, huh? Tomorrow, don't forget, you have your test in Argentina and Latin America. Um, okay. That's one of the questions we put you out of there. So we are ready with uh, our outlines repairing and the rubrics. Ready to go tomorrow. Okay. We'll go all around, all around. Okay. 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 I'm on Instagram. I feel like it would just be worth it. Do you guys want to go study tomorrow? Mm. I don't know. I don't know. I think, so. I, think we I think we covered it all like during class. Like we were reviewing. I don't know. Yeah, we okay. also we also would rather make it back in time than not. Like, okay, yeah. sorry. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I don't want to go to Adam's name. Okay, hey, will you guys please stay with us at lunch? Um, yeah. Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, tomorrow meet at my car, okay? Okay, yeah. Okay. Bye, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. 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 All right, so if we're studying tomorrow, should I, like, get something extra? Yeah? Yes. All right, yeah. Okay, let's go. Hell yeah! Hello? Okay, do you need me to go get her? Okay, I'll try to find coverage then. Okay, okay, bye. Uh, so we got like 15 minutes left, guys. We could do it, we gotta do it. Not ready for this. Okay, I brought a speaker yeah. so we can listen to okay. music while we So, study. also, I was just thinking. Yep. Hey, oh. hey no. hold up. Chloe. I'll take the first. Really? Hey. You guys really? Yeah. yeah. We're like in the middle of a park. Everyone take a shot. This will help us. Like, guys, not Pass it down. Pass it down. Here, here, here. I don't want this. I don't. I yeah, have no, take it, take it. Oh. She's driving us. She's fine. A little bit more time. Yeah, I'm jumping these. No, 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 no. I've got this. Don't, don't, don't.
Good morning to you, Ms. Moss. We're here because of you. And it's often that when we're here for people in cases like this, they think, wow, look at all the people that came just for me. But this is not a good day. This is not a day to celebrate anything because we're here because of what you decided to do one tragic day at school. I see you as someone who's selfish, and here's what I mean by that. You decided, despite the best efforts of society to convince you otherwise, to drink and drive. The fact that you had alcohol in your system, put people in your car, and then got in an accident doesn't surprise me. It never does. That's predictable. The fact that you got in an accident and killed someone is tragic. But again, it's not a surprise because that's what happens when you can't control your vehicle. And I say these comments now for the people that are gathered here today. I apologize in advance because I know I can't do justice today. My sentence is only designed to give some measure of punishment to Ms. Moss, but justice would be somehow being able to bring back your loved ones, and I just can't do that. There's nothing I'll say or do today that will be able to change that reality. And so for that, I apologize in advance. But what I hope we're able to accomplish today is to help you understand, Ms. Moss, the severity of your actions. or anybody else like to make a statement at this time they may. Yes, please. Thank you. Your Honor, I would like to make a brief statement. My beloved Justine is no longer with us because of a bad decision that has caused harm to not just me but to countless others. I will never hear her voice again. She will never graduate high school and she will never give me or anyone else a hug ever again. Emma, you have made a horrible choice to drive after drinking, and I cannot forgive you now, but I hope in time I will be able to forgive you. Thank you. You've broken people's lives in a way that won't ever be mended. And I imagine if you had been standing at your school that day, armed with the AR-15, and you were shooting at people that drove by, and you managed to kill a classmate, kill a teacher, and paralyze another classmate, you would have done the same harm in the almost the same way. Because by getting behind the wheel of your vehicle and driving and not paying attention after drinking, you caused all the same harm. And so for those reasons, I see this as an aggravated case, and I'm going to sentence you appropriately. So as to count one, a violation of Penal Code Section 191.5, that's gross vehicular manslaughter while intoxicated. I'm going to order that probation be denied, and you're committed to the Department of Corrections for a total term of 13 years. That's the upper term of 10 years for count one, and an additional three years consecutive for the true finding of the allegation of their penal code section 1192.7. So that's a total term of 13 years in the Department of Corrections. You've got credit for one day actual, 0.2933.1 credits for a total of one day credit. You're ordered to pay a restitution fine in the maximum amount of $10,000. Additional restitution fine of $10,000 will be stayed unless your parole is revoked. You're ordered to pay a court security fee of $40 immediate critical needs account fee of $30, criminal justice administration fee of $154. I'll reserve on the is issue of restitution to the victims in this case. Mr. Wilski, does your client waive her presence for any future restitution hearings? Yes, Your Honor, thank you. Thank you, we'll show a 977 waiver as to restitution. 
All fines, fees, and restitution once ordered will be paid pursuant to Penal Code Section 2085.5. You're ordered to submit to DNA testing pursuant to Penal Code Section 296. That'll be the order. Please go with my bailiff. I want you to take a moment today to think about how this impacted the other families that were involved because they've got loved ones that aren't going to have to worry about how much time they're going to be away before they come back to their families. They've got loved ones that won't ever come back to them. And for that, you're the person responsible. Thank you.